Yeah. How did you put that uh, round into terms for us? Uh, you know, I got off to a really good start battling some nerves uh, my first Canadian Open weekend. Uh, you know, it was a real treat to play with BJ and see some really tremendous golf uh, early on, but uh, didn't quite finish the way I wanted to, but uh, we got another day tomorrow. What did you see, what did you see playing alongside BJ? Oh, I, you know, he was just a gentleman. Uh, he was a real class act. Uh, it was real nice to, to play with him, and he keeps the game real simple. Fairways, greens, and putts, pretty simple game. Is there any intimidation when you're paired up with a guy like BJ? Not really. I mean, this is where I want to be. This is where my career is headed, and uh, it's just nice to play with somebody with, with a tremendous amount of experience, and you can absorb a lot uh, from them, and today was a great learning experience. How's the course playing? Obviously a lot of low numbers out there from some of the top players. Yeah, I mean, with no wind out here, um, soft conditions, uh, you know, I saw them watering the greens last night, so you can kind of fire up the pins out there today, and uh, they had some good good pin positions, and, uh, you know, you can take advantage of the par fives out here, which really helps. Plan of attack for tomorrow? Um, you know, just keep sticking to what I'm doing and uh, get some putts to drop, uh, just play steady and continue to learn and uh, develop my career. What's it like to walk up 18 and see the Canadian flag on the... It was a little tough today because I was way off course. <laughs> uh, I didn't get to absorb that too much. But, uh, you know, it means so much to me to play my National Open here, to play on the weekend in front of uh, the greatest golf fans in the world. And, uh, you know, I just, I'm just having a, a lot of fun out here, and uh, thanks to all the people that uh, are out there supporting. Thanks, thanks guys. Thank you, sir. Thanks, sir.